I'm so glad to finally be done. <laughs> we're, we're finally moving on into a world where the ratio is 50%. <laughs> and all-nighters come with paychecks. Uh, unless you're going to grad school. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> but I especially like today because it demonstrates the importance of who we have become in the process of who we are becoming. Our walk across this stage is meaningful, I think, not just because the future holds so much promise for us, but because what we have already done is just so promising. Let me tell you about a study real quick called Strauss Howe Generational Theory. It is a study that identifies four recurring generational patterns in American history. And they called us out on something a long time ago. They said that we would be the hero generation. Listen to their conjecture. See if you don't agree with them. We are a generation that will reclaim and rebuild broken societal institutions in response to a perceived threat to the nation's survival. We will ultimately rise up with social activism, collective confidence, civic engagement, and servant leadership. They say our main contributions will be revitalizing communities and advancing technology. They say that we may be the next great generation. We are, by and large, the generation that will rise up, step up, and stand up in the face of the world's greatest problems, and I think that the proof is in this room. I think about my friend Kevin, who invented a device to improve open heart surgery, and Melissa, who will be in Chile later this month, building a business to bring clean water to disaster areas, and some of my friends sitting out there who spend late nights walking the most dangerous streets of Atlanta, befriending victims of human trafficking, and freeing them from bondage. What I like about these people is how they're so focused on results and not recognition. They don't care as much about success as they do significance. While most people do their work in order to finish it, these people do their work in order to change the world. In Georgia Tech, that's us. At this stage in the game, Go Jackets is more than just a chant. It's an imperative. Tech alum, Dr. Alan Ecker, he played football for Coach Bobby Dodd, and he said something once that really stuck with me. He said to give it 100%, give it all you've got every play of the game, because you don't know what the big plays are until they're over. So as we walk across this stage, game on. Together, let's rise up as the next great generation. Go Jackets! Thank you, Corbin. Please accept this as a token of our appreciation as you and your colleagues go forward to change the world.